What up, what up, what up? It's The Real Illinois, back again with another video. Make sure y'all like, share, subscribe, turn on all post notifications, and leave a comment. Okay. Now, I know y'all wondering. What are three towels doing right there? What's the What, what does it represent? Okay, I'm going to let you know. See no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil. See no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil. Get it? Hear no evil, see no evil, speak no evil. Okay, and the reason why I'm saying that is because a lot of times we hear stuff. Oh, before I start, make sure y'all like, share, subscribe, turn on all post notifications and leave a comment. I thought I said it, maybe I didn't. But hear no evil, the reason why. I say hear no evil because you're going to hear stuff sometimes. Some of the stuff might be fabricated. Some of it might be true. Some of it, you know, it's just people just 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 like to fool around. But if it's not positive, you shouldn't even let it enter your domain. You should never let it enter your temple. It's okay to tell somebody, you know, when somebody talking about somebody, it's okay for you to say, you know what, man, I, I, re I rather not uh, have this conversation because I don't want to get involved. That's a nice way of saying, leave me out of it. You can say it your way, different ways, you know, you know, however you want to do it. But that's just how it came out. So that's probably how I would probably say that somebody was saying something. Because nine times ten, nine times ten, somebody talking about you, talking to you about somebody, they do it behind your back too. So then that was here. Your hear no evil. Um, speak no evil. So you, when you speak evil, you 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 when you when you're doing that, actually you could be setting yourself up for something premeditated, because you're already letting somebody know that that's what's on your mind. So you need to watch what you say, because if you say, let's just say you say, man, I swear, man, man, I'll do something to him or her, and then they end up dead. Guess who the first person they gonna come look for? Mr. or Mrs. Speak No Evil. Which I say speak no evil. I'm just saying. Y'all get what I'm saying. Speak no evil. But that's what I'm saying. Don't speak no evil. Because if you do, that's what could happen. You can set yourself up for somebody. This is like the last person that's with someone and something happened to them. You're the last person that's with them. So they're going to come for you. So speaking no evil. Speak, speak no evil. And then you don't have to worry about that. And the last one is see no evil. Now, see, that one is kind of touchy because if you see somebody doing something wrong, especially to a child or something like that, you 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 you're gonna want to say something, and and you probably should, depending on the circumstances. Now, and the circumstances are real slim. So if you see if you see some if you see somebody grabbing a child and they screaming to my help help. You you saying evil now? If you let that pass you by, then you're not even human, because even okay, it that could be the parent. True, but that might not be that might be the parent that doesn't have custody, so it could be like a pre amber alert. So when you see evil and recognize it for what it is, you got to determine is it enough for you to intervene or alert someone that can help you, that person if not you so hey you know what some of this stuff come, some of this stuff comes off the top of my head but don't forget hear no evil see no evil speak no evil those three things just like these tiles it's three things three and those three things are vital in the world because if you're not careful all three of them could get you in trouble. Y'all stay blessed. Peace.